Hello everyone, this is Taylor with Speed Sheets and today I'm doing a dessert to go with our bachelorette evening. Now this is a fun thing to do with your kids. We are doing a cinnamon roll casserole. So I got a bunch of cinnamon rolls that were on sale at Costco. It was like seven packages for like seven bucks or something. It was like the auntie's ones. So I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna start by putting two of these at the bottom of the pan and it's gonna be like a really fall centered one. So we're putting apples and eggnog in it. So I'm gonna show you how I do it and I'll catch you right back. Okay, so I added in two cinnamon rolls and one green apple. So I thought that would be really fall a couple weeks before Thanksgiving. So I thought this was a great dish. And then in here, I have three eggs, one cup of eggnog. You could also do this without eggnog. And then one cup of half and half or cup and half and half and half. And then I also added in a little bit of pumpkin spice and then I'm gonna add some nutmeg as well. I put the uh, frosting on the side and we're gonna drizzle that on top. So then we're gonna put this on high in our crock pot for about three hours, just in time, and there's my dogs, in time for The Bachelor. And then, what the heck, I'm gonna add in one tablespoon of maple syrup. Now for the maples, for the apples, I picked a lime green one or sour sour apple or you know Granny Smith apple uh, because I wanted to balance out the sweetness. So then we're just gonna pour on our custard, and that's it. And I will see you. And oh my goodness, one of my eggs did not mix. That's what I get for not using a spatula. So um, gotta toss that in there. Um, and then uh, we're gonna put this in for about three. Um, three and a half hours, three hours on low until everything is cooked. And then we're gonna top it with our frosting. You could also add nuts to this, which I probably will because no one has a nut allergy. Um, my sister and my sister-in-law is not here this weekend, so I can do that. And this is Speed Sheets. Um, I am on Instagram, follow me at speech underscore eats underscore SLP. I'm a speech therapist and I think crock pot meals are a great way to get kids involved in the kitchen. This is a great way where you can have the kids take the cinnamon rolls out and put them in at the bottom. They could squeeze the frosting on. They could pick which color apple they want to do. What's great about crock pot is that they can uh, do it themselves by putting the, putting the ingredients in. This is just a great fall and a holiday treat. And we're doing that because it's the bachelorette tonight. So I will see you in three hours when this is done. Bye. Hey everyone, our cinnamon casserole is done. It is amazing and is the perfect holiday treat. It looks fantastic. So I am Taylor with Speech Eats and I will catch you guys later. Bye.